The TAVR procedure is done in the heart catheterization lab. We enter through the groin with a very small incision, introduce a small tube through which a wire is tracked back to the aorta, and we cross the aortic valve with that wire. Once we've crossed with the wire, we can track a balloon and position a balloon in place within the valve that's severely narrowed, and we can inflate the balloon, thereby dilating up the valve and creating more room for our later implantation. After the valve is balloon dilated, we remove that balloon, and then we pass a larger tube up to facilitate the implantation of the valve itself. Once that tube is in place, we can now pass over the wire the valve itself, and we position that into place in the patient's original valve. We do that under x-ray techniques, and then we expand the valve with a balloon. That actually expands the valve into place inside the patient's native valve. So this procedure can be done all in the cath lab. When we're finished, we withdraw the, the balloon, we withdraw the wire, and then the groin is closed. And that can be done within usually one to two hours. The advantage is it's less invasive than open surgery. The patient does not need the chest um, cut into and does not need to be put on full cardiopulmonary support. In other words, have their heart stopped and put on a heart-lung machine.